Soka, look how it's a verse of me. <laughs> no, I don't believe it's will come my head. Oh, but I love this look, Joe. Hey, see that you're kiss sexy. Hey, fine man. Hey, read the TikTok now. See that is the TikTok. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Aids in there Williams. How are you all doing? Hope you guys are good. Hope you guys are fine. If you're new to my channel, you know what to do. Kindly click on the subscription button, click on the notification bell to let you know whenever I post any new video. Okay, guys, so you saw that video I put before I started talking. It's basically um Diane got a surprise visit from Joe. Now, some people again, people of the world, haba. How bad? So somebody cannot come and visit somebody again in peace. So it now turns out that, okay, oh, Diane is having something to do with Joe. No. The only thing I think they're having together is business. You know, you know, Joe is a creative person. Diane is a creative person. So please, people of God, let our baby girl for life be. Anyways, I'm sure you've heard of Isha Herbs and Naturals. Yes, I am going to talk, stop talking about them until you actually listen to me. Yes. Isha Herbs and Naturals, they have 100% organic products for your hair, mm -hmm, for your fellowshipping life, to make you enhance your fellowshipping life so that everything will be nice down there. You know, they have things for your health. You know, if you are a person that is having things like high blood pressure, diabetes, fibroids, they have 100% organic products that will help you take care of all those things without any side effects because who wants chemicals in their bodies these days okay guys moving on from that so adekule gold ag baby has a baby yes adekule gold and simi took to their instagram page yesterday to share this beautiful picture of adekule gold and their daughter are they not adorable and her name is adejare mm -hmm. so um adekule gold wrote um how he felt when he welcomed his daughter and he said it's been a lot right i know the violence against women against black people and this pandemic was just too much i had to log out for a bit i had to check out to prepare a healthy mind and a safe space to welcome my child into the world and even though i have sad feelings throughout i have okay i have sad feelings throughout the day about the crisis outside when i am with my baby it's pure on a adulterated joy i cried so much when adejare came out oh i cried when i first held her i can't lie i still stare at her and shed a few more lol i'm obsessed with all her expressions you need to see her stung face it's hilarious i have never seen a okay i have never seen any baby this beautiful oh i mean it my baby came out with a head full of hair like mine mm -hmm. and with the most beautiful face i've ever seen like Sibi. oh wow i feel so protective over her and everything hap happening right now has made me even more conscious of how i want to raise her i want her to always know she is loved she is powerful she is a pure black girl magic and i'll always believe in her yeah this is so beautiful people of god this is so 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 beautiful so according to simi um she said baby dejari arrived on the 30th of may so yeah we're so happy for them seriously we're so happy for them having a dad like adekule gold and a mom like simi whoa i'm sure that girl is gonna have the best vocals in the world anyways that's just me saying but this is so beautiful you know what adekule gold wrote he's gonna be a very good dad seriously i can't feel it he's gonna be a good dad that guy is gonna enjoy anyways so um uh, one of your popular musicians because it looks like today we are even at this video we are talking about musicians basically yes so one of them actually found love yes guess who mc galazio yes he has found love in fact he's taken he's off the market people of god and he decided to tell us yes to remind us that we are single and that he, he is taken and he went on to write this he said before now i never believed that that meets people refer to as falling in love mm -hmm. um in this new world of uncertainties 
accusations, war, brutality, hate, desperation. It seems happiness chose the right time to find me. Oh, why are they making me do that? Why are they doing all these things to me this morning? Anyways, I'll still read. Now that, um, okay. Now that you're my girl, I'm beginning to understand. Ever since we've met, we met, I felt a spring in my step and the world is a happier place. That's what love does to you. Like you just feel like everything is everything is good that there's there's nothing that can be wrong. Yeah. Um I wonder what tomorrow brings. Let's find out. Ladies and gentlemen, meet the queen of my heart. MCG's first and only lady, aka Freaky Freaky Mommy. Hashtag Ifunanya. Oh, congratulations to you. Congratulations to you. Me, I love love. I love love. So, yeah. Now, from one very, very lovey dovey to another love story that we don't know where this love story is gonna lead. Hey, <laughs> because hey, it looks like trouble in paradise. People are gone. It looks like hey, all is now well oh, with Shoma and David. Though, mm hmm. Now, I present to you the newest baby mama of our very own Obio. Yes, her name is Larissa Yasmin Lorenko, aka Larissa London. That is even her name on her Instagram page. She's a makeup artist born and raised in Angola, but moved to the UK and have been in David's life since 2017. People of God. Hmm. Now, there's this picture that Davido took with um, Cardi B, and I'm going to show you this picture. Yeah, that's picture. You could see her in the background. Yes. And um, hmm. it seems like Davido has a thing. I don't know. He just knows how to, his way with women and all that. Me, I don't know. Anyways, she took to her Instagram page about two days ago, if I'm not mistaken, to post a picture, which I'm not going to put here on my um, YouTube channel because YouTube. Yes. So um, it's like a semi-nude pic where she's showing her baby bump and all. And um, sources, you know, says that, that is actually an old pic. She put it out to make people, you know, think that she is still pregnant. But the truth is she actually delivered a baby boy back in March. So David Doe is not just Daddy Ifani. Ifani is not the only guy in David Doe's, you know, David Doe's son. He's not the only son of David Doe. He actually has two now, the second son. Now, um... This lady in question, this is not her first child, actually. She has a daughter. Yes, so. And according to what I heard, they said this whole baby came along around last year. Yeah, summer um, last year. That's summer of 2019, mid-summer 2019, you know. Um, that was where they did their fellowshipping and it, it resulted to this baby boy. Yes, he said that when David was back and forth in the U.S., first for his second daughter's birthday, then a brief Euro tour back in the U.S. for Memorial Weekend show. Next, in Ni um, he came back to Nigeria again um for his first daughter's hair product launch we all remember when that happened then he went back to us again in june for a show in philadelphia and branched afterwards to new york <laughs> that was where he now went to do the fellowship that gave us this baby congratulations to you david Dom. now um people of god hmm it's also said that this same Larissa was also with him at the Afrofest Portugal that happened back in August 2019. Uh-huh. But Sotis says, you know, we've heard bloggers, you know, that the video has been denying this baby and even blocked access to him. Like, he blocked her from having access to him. But also, some some you know beds have been whispering that that's not the only thing that happened though that the video actually gave her money you know to settle her so that she will not come out and talk and some people have actually said that she at some point started contacting our chef choma <laughs> it's gonna be a funny something it's gonna be a funny something because this lady does not look like a lady that's gonna close her mouth oh people of god what do you think 
And they said the video, you know, blocked her and started doing all this. Um, you remember? Okay, I don't know if I reported to you guys. The video um, blocked so many people um, and said, if you can't contact me, that's because he wants to have time for himself and all that. Yeah, that was the time he decided to block her and all those things, according to what I heard, you know. And yeah. Mm hmm. People, they said that the video is trying to save face. Um, and because for ever since this whole news started making, because this news has been around, it, it was a rumor, you know, at first. It's been around for some time. And things has not really been rosy between the video and Chioma. Yeah. And according to the news, both of them have been living apart, you know. And they might just come back, you know, to do a photo shoot to tell us that it's not true. But we all know. We all know that things are kind of falling apart. We don't want that to happen. But basically, this is what is happening. So, what do you guys think? Because I don't understand. Like, how many kids does the video have now? Like, the confirmed ones, baby Fanny, um... Sophia Mombodo's daughter, the other girl, and this one, two boys, two girls. And there's this other one that um our anti-investigative journalist talked about, you know, that he had with some woman some time back. I do not understand, people of God. What are your what do you think about all this? Is it that he cannot hold himself? Is it I don't understand? Like you have a woman like Chef Chi in your life. What more can you what more do you want, Davido? Seriously, these are facts that has presented itself. And he has not come out, you know, openly to say this is not true. Or, you know, say something. Say something. You know, that kind of thing. Ha! People of God. Anyways, that's, 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 that's it. Because really, I do not know what to think right now. I'm actually, um, I feel kind of bad, you know, for Chef Chi because... Ah, I'm a girl, so this kind of thing is not something that, you know, I would love for myself. You know, this kind of thing is not something I would love for myself. So this kind of thing, you tell me, people of God, let me know your thoughts on this in the comment section. So I'm going to end this video by reading this beautiful tweet by a Proko doctor. He is well known on Twitter. And he said something, uh, in fact, he wrote down something and I feel the need to read, um, to share with you guys. And he said... Disagree with others without insulting them. Correct people without making them look stupid. If you don't have nice things to say about a person's picture, don't say anything. People are going through a lot. The least you can do is to be kind. Be kind or be silent. So I think this is self-explanatory. I don't really have to go you know, much into it to explain anything. Be kind. It, it takes nothing to be kind to people. You know, even in the comment sections, even if people disagree with your opinion, it's fine. Everybody is not going to be the same. You know, even if you feel that person is wrong, you can actually correct that person with some level of respect, knowing that the person is a fellow human being like you, you know. Yeah, don't disrespect people online and offline. Don't do that. Okay, guys, thank you so very much for being part of my channel. Yeah. I hope you enjoyed the gist today. If you're new to my channel, you know what to do. Kindly click on the subscription button. Click on the notification bell to let you know whenever I post any new video. And you know one of the beautiful ways you can support me is by watching my art. It's not going to cost you anything. Okay, maybe some of your data. And I will appreciate it. And it's going to make me smile. But please help me with the art. Thank you so much, guys. Until I come your way again, which I will very soon. Because we're going to talk about Big Brother. Yeah, we're going to talk about Big Brother. The reunion is going to be airing today. So, um, yeah. Till then, have a beautiful day. And have fun. Bye, guys.